know I'm not a villain. You, you just think I'm a villain because I'm petting a cat and because my hair's slicked back and because I've got an eye patch. But I'll have you know that 40 million American households have a cat and lots of people slick their hair back these days. It's pretty much the in fashion choice. But <laughs> while we're on the topic of subverting expectations, I wish Daniel Craig would subvert some of mine. These new Bond films act like they've purged Bond of his cartoonish sensibilities and created a more realistic picture of a world-trotting, woman-seducing super spy. Gone are the days of the quippy one-liner. When one is in Egypt, one should delve deeply into its treasures. The themed villain. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Ernst Stavro Blofeld. The laser wristwatch. Now he's just Jason Bourne in a tuxedo. But that really doesn't make him more realistic. Here's something that realistic spies don't do. Introduce themselves with their actual first and last name. The name's Bond. James Bond. Oh, you're, you're James Bond, the, the international spy and villain foiler? Oh, no, 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 I'm James Bond, the importer, exporter? People aren't buying it, all right? What a helpful chap. And anyways, we don't like James Bond because he's realistic. We like him because he takes the complicated world of international relations and military diplomacy and reduces it to a battle between good and evil, where one sexy white colonialist is all you need to keep you safe at night. It's all right. I'm not supposed to be here either. I take it you're not. And I guess that's fine, the noble lie or whatnot, but it teaches the wrong lesson, which is that what we need to save our messed up world is sex and violence, when really we need more openness and understanding. If only Q could provide us some of that. Oh, grow up, Dudley. Uh, hey, hey, boss? Yeah? It's time to feed the piranhas. Now just throw one of the producers to them. Thank you. And good night. <laughs> Just throw one of the producers in there. <laughs> really hurt. <laughs>